Oh my gosh, new Pokemon trailer. Um, yeet. So I saw this when I was in school. Uh, I was just on YouTube, you know, uh, not doing work, as you do. And I saw this in my recommended, and I om in my recommended, and I almost watched it, and I was like, ugh, I gotta make a video, don't I? So, here we go. Here's some content. Some very, very bad content. Let's... Let's watch this. The only thing that I know is because there's Galarian forms now, and I know that because everyone is covering this already. So, let's do it. Please take it back. Why is this a fairy type? And it has an unknown ability, of course. Why does this exist? Oh my god, there was a kid in school who literally had this up, and I was like, P is that real? And he said, no, I'm pretty sure it's fake, it has an artist handle. Oh my god, that was real. I hate this with every nerve in my body. I want it to die. I really hate this. <laughs> Galarian Zigzagoon? Why? Ooh, but a new- but a- finally a dark normal combo. That's nice, but why does this exist? <laughs> It's as if they literally just made it smiling, and they took the fill bucket tool, and just like, black and white. We did it, guys. <laughs> Obstagoon? Wait a minute. If... Zigzagoon is in another game. Does that mean they have to get they have to make it like a non-Galarian form one? Please let them do that. I want to see a normal Obstagoon. Yeah, I I honestly don't like this as much cuz it was in the trailer thumbnail, but I honestly thought it was more of just like a Dynamax, but no, this is an evolution. Probably, they probably could have done more with it, but I'm, I guess I'm fine with it for now. I love it, and I want nothing bad to ever happen to it. I want it to stay perfectly fine and normal forever. Oh, this is the Pikachu clone. More Pico. Or Mo more Pico. Oh, it's an electric dark type. <laughs> or a wheel move changes from electric to dark type. Oh, so it's a normal electric, and then it changes to dark type. Okay. Hangry mode? I mean, it's a person. <laughs> oh my gosh. Team Yell. So the, everything in the leak is right. I mean, the t evil team is actually Team Yell. It's Mer... Marnie's wild fans. Okay. 
Okay, so that was a lot of information. Most of it wasn't great. I mean, I, I'm, I'm going to go back. But if I can find any of the right frames. Okay, Galarian Weezing. I really just don't like it. Like, I, n normal wheezing was fine. I get that what they were doing was, like, a top hat, but also, like, the smokestack sort of thing. Which is a good and, like, a neat concept, but... They could have executed it a lot better, I think. Okay. More Zigzagoon. That's Lie Noon. Okay, there we go. Galarian Zigzagoon. I, I don't know. It's all right, but the last, the only reason they did a Lola forms was originally, originally, so they could do the type matchups and the type balances for when they did Pokemon Let's Go. Because if you notice, only Gen One Pokemon got um, a Lola forms, and a lot of them were Dark and Ice type. Some of them were, one of them was Fairy. They did that so they could balance out the games more. Because if you notice in Gen 1, Psychic is kind of overpowered. So they gave some of the basic Pokemon new forms to make them dark type. Stuff like that. Um, so I... They're not going to be doing Gen 1 or Gen 3 remakes because they just did Gen 1. And um, they did Gen 3 as, like what, 2014? So... I mean, whatever Diamond and Pearl remakes are next. Maybe, you know, give Sinnoh Pokemon. Sinnoh Pokemon could probably get some help. Like, you know, Finneon and Luminion, who are probably some of the most forgetful Pokemon ever. Make them something insane, like Water Psychic or like Water or Psychic Dragon. I don't know how you'd be able to pull that off, but if you did, that would be absolutely amazing. So... Oh my god, Beware is in the game? Ugh, I love it. Galarian Linoon. Literally, like I said, they gave it a smile and a fill bucket tool. And also some weird steel hands things. Honestly, they definitely could have done more. Like, think of Alolan Sandshrew. Like, they gave it a more flat look. They gave, they, obviously they repalated it, but they made it an ice steel type, which is what they do, but then they actually gave it unique things. Like, with Alolan Sand Slash, they, they made its claws ice picks. Here, they put gray stuff around its Claws, and uh, that's it. Really? Obstagoon. Oh, I get it, because it's an obstacle. I'm guessing it's a defensive Pokemon. Oh my god. It also kind of looks like it's based off a of biker. Yeah, I don't really. Not really feeling this. Nope, I don't want to. Like, it's not a bad design, but out of all the Pokemon you could have given evolutions to, Linoon isn't one of them. It It's not. <sighs> I love it. It's literally, it's literally just a Pikachu clone. Like, Game Freak is now obligated. The Pokemon company is now obligated to design a Pikachu clone every generation. Because merchandise sells. <laughs> Hunger Switch.
its design is good, but its in-game thing looks a bit saturated. <laughs> or does the purple just like not look good on it in the game? Or like an old man, like a very, very old man. Yeah, so that was it, and I am confused. I don't know what they're doing. I feel like this is this is their first game on the Switch. I feel like they're trying to just do it all. Like, I think they're just throwing everything at the wall and then just seeing what sticks. And so far, it's like they're throwing water at the wall. It's like, it's staying there and then it's just dripping right off. Like, not even close to staying. Because Dynamax is alright, but I don't really think I'm ever going to use it. Gigantamax, I know I'm not going to use because it's just Mega Evolution. But bigger. So, I don't know why Game Freak is lying to themselves about that. Um, Galarian Forms. They're alright. Could have been better. What else is there in this trailer? Oh yeah, Team Yell. Um, I would have liked more than one trainer sprite than just, um, you know, one male and female. Like, I get that every game has only had one male sprite and one female sprite. But, you know, maybe just, like, don't. <laughs> because at this point, like, there was a gang of them. They all look the same. Like, there's no difference at all. I don't. I don't know. Maybe once I play the games, I'll have a different opinion. But probably not, honestly. I just don't like... Oh. I don't like Dynamax or Gigantamax or some... The Galarian forms that we know exist. Um, but other than that, I don't think there's really a lot to say. But the games... Even though I've been hating on them, they look good. They look beautiful still. I don't know why anyone's complaining about the graphics. Like, did you see that first trailer? Like, it's absolutely beautiful. But, I don't know. Some people don't understand how Pokemon works. <clears throat> Distant Kingdom. Who I'll be making a video on, by the way. Because his complaints make absolutely no sense whatsoever when they inadvertently contradict themselves. So... Yeah, I'm gonna make a video on him, but, yeah, I mean, that's pretty much it. Pokemon Sword and Shield looks good. Can't wait for this video to get copyright claimed. Nintendo. I mean, Pokemon Company, really, but Nintendo. How do I even, like, not do this? Okay, there we go. Bye.